don't make new friends. I'm too busy making love. Hugh Gallagher isn't just the man behind the 80s Belgian pop star character Von Von Von. Scores of dating hopefuls with writer's block have stolen a college essay he wrote nearly two decades ago when he was 17. It's become one of the most copied documents in the online dating scene. That essay helped Mr. Gallagher get into New York University. It also took first prize in a writing contest. It features over-the-top boasts such as, I translate ethnic slurs for Cuban refugees, write award-winning operas, and cook 30-minute brownies in 20 minutes, and ends with the lines, I have played Hamlet, I have performed open-heart surgery, and I have spoken with Elvis but I have not yet gone to college. It was 1989, and I was applying for colleges, and I thought it was really absurd for them to ask me at that age, you know, who I was or what I'd done, because I hadn't done anything. So I just made up a lot of lies just to entertain myself. After being frustrated for it for a little while, I was just like, you know, I'm going to have fun with this. So that's what started the essay. The essay became one of the most forwarded emails of the 1990s, according to some sources, and it's popped up in other places. The essay was sent to many different colleges, and uh, I attended NYU, and it was also entered in a writing contest, which I won first place in a national writing contest in 1990, and then it was published in Harper's Magazine, because one of the judges of the contest knew someone at Harper's, and then um, John Kennedy Jr. saw it, He read it, and he called me up at my dorm, my freshman year dorm at NYU, and he's like, this is great, I love it, I want to meet you. So uh, we had a drink together at the White Horse Tavern, and he gave the essay to Jan Wenner, who's the founder of Rolling Stone, and then I started writing features for Rolling Stone when I was still a teenager. It's been used in personal ads before. It's been used on a lot of different websites. People have put it on their sites saying this is kind of funny. It's been used on college entrance websites. It's been used on the radio uh, for personal profiles, like anywhere that someone has something like that, whether it's for dating or professional profiles, sometimes people have used it. It was printed in a book of urban legends because it got to a point where people didn't think I existed. And uh, it was actually published in a book that I didn't exist and no one ever wrote this. And I had to get a lawyer and stop the presses and say, you know, I wrote this. This is my essay. And that uh, that was pretty funny. A recent search on Match.com alone brought up more than 50 dating profiles containing phrases from Mr. Gallagher's essay. Some copiers admit to stealing from Mr. Gallagher, now a writer in New York. Jim Carrey, a pharmaceutical salesman, says he copied the essay because he wanted to show he was funny and he couldn't come up with a clever phrase himself. And then there's Cliff Cotton from the New York area, who claims he came up with the lines back in 1989. As for Mr. Gallagher, he says if the plagiarizers are just looking for love, then he doesn't mind them cribbing. For The Wall Street Journal, I'm Jennifer Sereno. To you.